everyone, this is Little Miss Bun Crazy, and today I am doing my Christmas hauls for Cadbury, for Christmas presents kind of thing. Let's get into it. So the first thing that I got for Cadbury is from the dollar store. It's a tunnel. It is blue, um, because his red one is starting to, he's got the holes poking out of the top here. There's like a wire poking out, so I thought he better you could use the new one. And since it's Christmas, um, I thought he could use have for Cadbury is this woven mat. Um, it took me not too long. It was actually really easy to make. You just cut a whole bunch of slips and slits in this way and then you cut out a whole bunch of strips of cardboard and there you go. And I just thought I'd get this for it, make this for him since it's good to have um, different textures in their cages as well. And I just, it took me like five, ten minutes to make this so it wasn't a big deal. And I kind of messed up at the beginning and then it looks better down here. Thing I'm getting for or got for Cadbury made for Cadbury is this cardboard curtain toy that I will link in the description box below. How to make this? This took me forever because I had to cut out, punch all those with a pen and cut out all those things because the one I originally made for him is um, really ripped and I thought I could use a new one. So yeah, he loves this toy. Although he destroys it in like five minutes and it takes you like so long, but. You know, he has fun, so that's good. And then you just usually just, I usually just put the pieces, the little piece of paper, I put them back all in after a couple of days, and then he gets the more fun of ripping those all out until they're like basically completely gone, and then the toys sits there for a little bit until I remake it again. So he hasn't had this toy um, in a while, so I thought I'd give it to him. I made um, this little ball thing, it just took um, two pieces of cardboard, cut them out, and cut a hole down the middle of both of them. And up with this, so yeah. Next thing I made for him is this hay bag thing. I don't really know. It's just like kind of like a treat bag almost. He loves this. He loves ripping up the bag and he makes it on all like like there's hay in it. He just loves ripping up the bag. So I thought I'd make this for him again this year because he hasn't had it probably since either his birthday or Christmas. So I thought he could use it again. This is kind of like a holiday cracker. It's got two pieces of toilet paper roll and I just put some hay inside here and some pellets and then wrapped it up with paper. And, yeah. This is the final thing. I saw someone else that made this but they used tape so I was figuring, trying to figure out a way how to use it without making tape and I just, so I'll link that video down below if you want to know how to make this because she made it and it was a really good video. And, um, but she made it with tape so I was trying to figure out a way to make it without tape and I was like, oh, you tie two pieces of string in the middle of the end to make a big giant knot at the end of it. That's how you did it. Mine isn't as circular as I wanted it, kind of turned out to be square. Oh well, I forget what, what you call this. Um, but I will definitely leave that link in the description box as well. She made it. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it gave you some ideas of maybe things you could make for your bunny for Christmas because store bought toys are expensive and they usually demolish them within like five minutes and these ones take less than five minutes to build so I hope you get some ideas and keep your buns happy and healthy. Thanks, bye!